Hey love, so it's your girl April and I'm going to do a makeup tutorial. This is like my everyday easy go-to makeup look. I think it's everyday because if I don't put a whole bunch of eyeshadow and all of that extra jazzy stuff, then it's simple to me. You know what I'm saying? So anyway, this is going to be a talk through and I don't really do those too much. So just be aware that this is going to be extra long, girls, but it's going to be so fun. So let's get into this makeup look. So first thing is first, um, I already put on my eyebrows as you can see. It took me like 20 minutes because I was talking to my son and just redoing them. Oh my God, some days I have like a really good day. But anyway, so I'm going to use this um, rose water. But this is by Terry, Cellular Rose. Roses, Native Cells. This stuff is like so amazing. But can you see how much you get in this bottle? Like you get a lot of this in the bottle and I really, really love it. And it smells like so floral like it really smells like roses you want to get in the video sugar mm -hmm. come here and I really do like this stuff I have like another brand which is by unique the bottle is like so tiny this is like the right amount and it really smells like roses it's time for the fun part. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to use um, my Derma Doctor Picture Perfect Pour. So this just is the pore minimizer and I love this stuff. I use it like, um, I wouldn't say daily, only use it if I'm using makeup, putting makeup on my face. So I use this. But the cue to using this is, well for me, Make sure you use a moisturizer because to me it seems like it kind of like not burns but I can feel like it on my skin tightening so I always use like some type of moisturizer first which was the rose water that I used. Okay. So the first things first is I'm going to do my eyes like my eye area. I'm not really going to put eyeshadow on my eyes today but I'm going to use my Born This Way um, foundation by Too Faced to kind of like even my eyelids out. Take a little tiny dot. This is probably way too much. I'm going to use this, which is my Real Technique sponge. I love this sponge. And I actually forgot to put on my eyeshadow primer, but who even cares? Okay. You don't really need it like that because I'm, this is going to be like an eyeshadow primer. I'm just going to dab this over my entire lid because I want to even out the color. I'm going to let that dry. I'm going to use my Too Faced Prime and Poreless. I love this stuff. Like, it is heaven. Okay, so since they are almost dry, I'm going to be using my Pure Minerals Press Foundation. And this is in the color tan. I love this stuff. I actually got it from Octoly. Um, like weeks ago and I absolutely love this. So I'm going to apply this on my lids with a Sonia Kashuk fluffy brush and I'm just applying this on my lids because it's going to be kind of like my setting powder for my lids. I'm not really going to do too much to my lids. Just kind of like even my, my tone out. Perfect. Nothing, nothing special. Nothing popping. You know. I am not that great with doing winged eyeliners because I have like hooded eyelids. So I am really not that great with doing winged eyeliners. Um, I kind of like got to start off with like something really minimal. Like I'm going to use this Milani um, black gold foil eyeliner, kind of cream eyeliner. I'm going to use that with this um, Dillium Tools. And it's really small, this brush, like really super small. So it makes it easy for me. But like I said, I'm really not that great. For me to do this, it has to be like super quiet. So like, quiet, don't say anything because I have to really concentrate. See like it's coming along. It's not like really black. Okay, so now that I finally got these correct, 
I'm gonna use this really cheap eyeliner. It's a dollar. It was from Shop Miss A. This is the Santee Liquid Eyeliner. I love this stuff. It's just like the LA Colors um, one, but to me, I think this one is better for some reason. Better than the LA Colors one. So I just go over it to make it really black. And Okay, so same concept. This I buy from the Dollar Tree all the time. I get like a bunch of them. This is the LA Colors Liquid Eyeliner. And only a dollar, so cannot go wrong. Okay, so while that is drying, I'm just going to go ahead and put my foundation on. So I wanted to use this new stuff, which I tried out, which is Vibeline. I think that's how you say it. Vibeline, Vibeline, okay. And this is a cream foundation. And the color I have is medium dark in number one, which is the yellow undertones. So it has this like this snazzy little thing that you can flip over it in a mirror. I got this from Octoly. So I'm gonna see how this works out. Um, it seems a little dark for my skin tone, but I'm going to dull it down. So it does come with an applicator sponge, one of these, but I don't really like to use these too much. So we're gonna try this out. Now I do have a favorite that I've been using like for the past week, which is this here, the Ardency in Americana. I love this stuff. Um, perfect coverage, but you know what? We're just gonna try it out today. Where are you going? Sugar. Hey. Hi. So if you guys are aware, if you follow me on Snapchat and Instagram, I do have a new dog. I still have my mini Dachshund for those of you who have been following me for years named Coco. But I also now have a mini poodle which I adopted from Halo Rescue, Dog Rescue or Animal Rescue. Um, it wasn't my intention that they took get a dog. We was just going to the mall basically to drop, drop my son off the ground. The mall that we went to is Metro Center Mall. It's really dead, but I like to go there because they have like the Rainbow Clothing Store, which has plus size, and they're cheap. So, so we walked through the entire mall. Okay, so like, I'm gonna say it like this: like the mall should have like 120 stores. Out of 120, there's probably like 40 that are open. But it's really a cool mall because it's not busy. And I only go there for certain things, and they ha so happen to have the Halo Rescue Center. So we went there just to look at the pets. What kid doesn't like to go look at the pets? And my daughter fell in love with this dog named Sugar, who was eight years old, and it's a rescue center. She was twenty-five bucks, and the day I got her, um, I got her the same day. Of course, she needed to be fixed up, you know, like groomed or whatever. So we did groom her and stuff, and. She is like so clingy to me. Like, say hi, right? So her ears are purple and pink, and her little paw paws, and she's got them two gloves, right? Say hi. So her name is Sugar, because that was her name already, and she's so clingy to me. I bought her like a whole bunch of outfits already on eBay, didn't I? Yes. And she just like adores me, huh? What do you think? What do you think? Mm hmm. Tell them what your shirt says. Show them. So it says wide, wildly, wide, wild, widely, wildly cute. You want to be shy on camera? Yes, you go play. Okay, so I used the Vivalin, I think that's how you say it. And the coverage is not too bad. Um, it's pretty decent. Of course, it does make me look a little um, darker. I got to go back for myself, Tanny. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my beauty sponge and I'm going to like dab it in, kind of like blend it a little bit more. It's not really full coverage like the other one um, unless you put like more coats to it, but I don't really want too much so I'm going to just try a tiny bit more.
sell it down a little bit, whatever. So I'm going to be using my Mary Kay Time Wise Matte Foundation in beige four. And this is just for my um, highlight under my eyes. This is easy. If you wanna go outside, You wanna go outside? Go ahead, go outside. Go outside with Nick. So I let that dry and I'm going to also use my contour from NYX, the go-to palette. This is like amazing. There are six eyeshadows and a contour, a highlight, and a blush. I love this stuff with this cheap old brush from um, Wet and Wild. Get this from like any drugstore. Mm -hmm. I don't know how I feel about this foundation from uh, Bevel. I don't really. I'm thinking I'm liking it. Yeah, I don't really think I like this foundation because it kind of seems like it's skipping, whatever. But we'll see. I'm gonna blend this in now because it's kind of like dry enough. a huge fan of this foundation um, it doesn't really go well with my other foundation so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use the elf cream eye foundation stick in the color nude um, just for a little more highlight because this um, foundation by Vibeline or whatever it's not that great not in my opinion it's not I don't really like it so. I'm gonna use my Morphe NC Contour Palette. What? Well, she needs to go somewhere. And I'm just going to use this color, which I'm in pan. I love it. I love it. I'm gonna contour my nose with the Color Pop uh, Super Sh Super Shock Cheek in blue side. I'm just gonna go lightly. Just give me a bronze kind of look. I'm just gonna kind of drag that over my eyes. Kind of like warm it up. Contour as well. So to warm up my eye area, because I want a little bit of warmth in my eye area, nothing dramatic, just a little bit of warmth. I'm just going to take this Morphe 35F palette and I'm just going to warm it up a little bit. So I'm just going to use like this color right here. Nothing too dramatic. And I'm just gonna dip into this color right here a little bit. Perfect. So just to highlight just a little bit under my eyes, um, I just want a little bit of sparkle. I'm gonna take, uh, let's see, we're gonna take this color right here. We don't want anything too dramatic. Just going to put that kind of like in the center. Nothing heavy. As you can 
see it's like really light. lashes and I'm using my favorite mascara which is by Too Faced Size Queen. I think this is Size Queen Mascara. The brush is like really big. I love this. And I have individuals on always. So that's why you never see me put any lashes on. Yeah, that goes and it looks like I need to brighten up the tail ends of my okay so I'm just gonna dust off this excess powder which I used was the um, Morphe's. Time to clean my brushes. Okay, so for under my eyes, I'm just going to warm them up just a little bit. So I'm gonna go into this palette by the NYX Go To palette. Nothing special. And I don't really use like a whole bunch of different kind of brushes. So I'm just gonna take the same Morphe brush, um, Sedona brush, excuse me. I'm just going to go into this bronzy light color. color that's in this the stuff is like so bright and I'll apply that it's kind of like that Morphe eyeshadow color too but it's all the same stuff well I think the Morphe is a little bit more pigmented but either way so then I will I don't really use like a dark color let's see Do my lower lashes and I'm also going to plump my lips with my Too Faced Lip Injection, Extreme Lip Injection. The Too Faced Better Than Sex Waterproof Mascara. Like fill your lips tingling like whew. ooh chap. Mm. This is this pure minerals press powder press foundation powder. Again, I love this stuff. Oh my god. This stuff is like life, really. Seriously, this is like life. Okay. I'm just saying, I'm just saying. Some of the Scandinavia setting spray. Okay. New favorites, which is the Becca Cosmetics and Jaclyn Hill. This is their highlighter, and this is, or the Shimmering Skin Perfector. This is Champagne Pop with Jaclyn Hill. I love Jaclyn Hill. She's so, she's absolutely funny. And that's what I like a lot about her. So I'm just gonna use this cheap little brush. I don't have one of those little tiny fan brushes. I'm just going to jab that right here because the glow is freaking real, okay? The glow is real with this. Oh my God. The glow is so real with this. Like seriously. Nose. Right there. Right here. And then I'll just take my Sedona Lace um, Jumbo Fan and, you know, hook it up, hook it up, panties. And then on top of that, because if the glow is real, but don't be fooled. This NYX glow right here, oh my God, this is so overpowering. This entire palette is $15, so you can get mad. You can get like a bunch of stuff for less, you know what I mean? Like, look at that. Do you see that? I just want to look like, I don't know, a strobe light. Like, a 
galactic freaking astronaut, okay? I want you to be blinded by my glow today. And a little bit of blush, just a little. I'm gonna use something really inexpensive, and this is the e.l.f. Um, blush and Berry Merry. I've had this for some time. It's a really pretty color. I'm just gonna dap it on a little bit. So I'm gonna be using one of my favorite lip liners, uh, new favorite lip liners, which is by Beauty For Real. This is the only one they have, and it's supposed to be the only one you need, and I absolutely love it. It's like this pretty color. Ultra Satin Liquid Lipstick by uh, ColourPop, which is my favorite one, which is Little Stitches. That is like my everyday look. So, of course I have to do my hair and just be prepared for that. I'll show you that in a minute. So, something really simple and inexpensive. Be right back. And make sure you rate, comment, subscribe, and thumbs this video up if it was helpful. And as well as that, as I will see you girls and guys in my next video. So stay diva and delicious.